啦啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Swellbard, where I'm definitely a little bit rusty on this game, and things have been getting a little bit dodge. But it's fine. We are working through it, and training is always going to be、uh, the key for this one.、Um, and、uh, we are doing a lot of training,、um, lots and lots of training.、Um, we are working on the Roachburger Scandal project. But what we could do, we now have a training room available here, so we could、um, get Miles. Oh no, Miles isn't quite ready yet. Fair enough. Let's get him back to work because we're very close to getting him trained up to level three research. That's going quite well. But、um, we do have a bottleneck with、um, our diagnostic process. Um, that's not amazing,、um, which means that we can't get enough people to the treatment facilities, and then of course we're, we're not really training our treatment people at the moment. We are very much concentrating on the diagnostic bottleneck.、Um, I'd like to, I think, upgrade our diagnostic helixer、um, and see about doing some more training、um, because they don't have masses.、Um, but the first step. Of course.、Um, what's happening with you? Okay, treatment failed. So the first step is getting our GPs、um, in a pretty good state. Let's have a look. So GP three. And. We'll, we'll get her back. I mean, she was she was just leaving, but we'll get her back. Let's <laughs> just turn around and come back. <laughs>、um, and then diagnostic nurses.、Um, we have one that we could train. What we'll do is we will train them in diagnostic too.、Um, ah, I was thinking because、oh, it's diagnostic too. Actually, we won't we won't do it. Just yet. What we might do? Ah,、oh, should we do some more ward, ward training? Hmm. We should do some more ward training. Um, not fracture for the moment, but the other ward. Um, let's let's see here. Not the fracture. So we've got June. Because again, we've got a treatment and a diagnostic ward, and I don't really know. We're just going to have to pull them randomly, I think. But no, but I don't. I don't want the don't fracture. Much, Maureen and Lily, are they ready? I didn't check. Very observant.、Um, Maureen and Lily, get them going. What is this? Avalanche. Let's have a look. It's not too bad, is it? We might request some maintenance on some of our. Do you know what? We might actually get an upgrade on that one. Yeah. Okay. Get some maintenance on you. That's being upgraded, so we could start upgrading perhaps one treatment and one diagnostic machine at a time. That might be, that might be a nice mix. That might be a nice mix. I did do some customer service training actually.、Um, let's get the last one done because when you get to customer service three, they also start、uh, giving、um, the people they serve a happiness boost. Uh, which would be great. That would be great.、Oh, I, think, I think he's a bit tired. Can't get him when he's on the sofa. You're right. You're right. Look at this customize option. We can、um, use customized wallpapers and floors now. In the latest update of Two Point Hostel, we all have、uh, this available to us.、Um, 
I have a, a bundle on the Steam Workshop of my own wallpapers and things. Uh, they're Blah Blah themed. I'm probably going to do some other bundles in the future that um, uh, are not Blah Blah themed and, and uh, more sort of um, for the hospital. <laughs> but if you'd like Blah Blah things, you can indeed have them uh, in your hospital. Um, let's see here, because we've got user-generated stuff. Look at this. So we could put like a, a Blah Blah rug in our... Mmm, <laughs> you know. Oh, look, look, it's a, a Patreon tier <laughs> of mine. Um, and so my Patreons can start getting their names in the game. Um, I was thinking, something I was thinking about was uh, maybe starting to name rooms, departments and stuff after um, Patreons, after peeps. Um, you know, and maybe, it's been, uh, one peep suggested that maybe we could even, uh, give them their own posters to go with it. Um, I do kind of like this idea. I do kind of like this idea, but I've only just launched my Patreon, so I don't really have many, many VIPs, very important peeps at the moment. But maybe, if, uh, the numbers grow, I might, uh, do something like that. I think that could be pretty cool. I think that could be pretty cool. Look at our cure rate. That is unbelievable. Um, actually, literally unbelievable. I, I don't really know how that's happened. Um, so, anyway, enough faffing about. We've got that training going on. Now, I like the idea of helping Forbes here start upgrading machines faster. So we're going to put him in some training to do that. Um that might be nice. And do you know what we might also do? I think that we should do some stamina training for our janitors. Now, who 110 165 Bob Hogsback. My goodness. You could be our man that's going to to train the others. Anybody else who's uh, super crazy at training? No. We'll put Rich in as well. There we go. That might be nice. So what's going on with our GPs? So we have a... We could do with getting Richard Tart here to a level 3. Um, and you know what? We might use one of our existing... Is anyone on call? No, they're all perfectly busy. Oh well, I'm still going to pull them out. So that's uh, a bunch of uh, training done. Oh, he's ready. Oh no, that's... How close are you? You've got a little way to go, Miles. Fair enough. Fair enough, Miles. Here comes all of our people to be trained. Sophie to do some training. Excellent. Cure 20 patients. We could give it a go. I mean, we could give it a go. 74% um, on this scandal has been researched. That's fantastic news. Um, customer service is almost done here. That's brilliant. Shall we maybe consider doing some nurse training? Some more... Some more ward. Ooh, did you see how unhappy they are? Some more ward training. And we might... Take loads and we're going to take loads away. Yeah, I'm a bit worried. We've just sent both of our fracture nurses. <gasps> or oh, did I get lucky? We got, we got lucky. <laughs> we did indeed. That's fine. Wow. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. Shall we get rid of this? Oh, what we'll do first... Four patients. I mean, staff. Let's give everybody a 1% pay rise. And I think we might build a reception room. Uh, here. But. I do like the idea. Of making it a little bigger. I think we might get rid of that. I'll put that here. Right, let's try again. So, reception room. 
and then we might uh, we won't put we won't do that give them a radiator um, I'll give them some cabinets charity pot maybe some nice flowers well, it doesn't sound like it's going terribly well out in the hospital, does it? We're killing an awful lot of patients. Um, so I'll do that. And get rid of this. Now, we should employ... Hire a new assistant. I think we're going to hire you. And we're going to hire you. Are either of them available? Yeah, look, they could both do some customer service training as well. Typically, it's the person <laughs> that was attending. God damn it. God damn it. Okay, let's see here. Look, Rich Nut and uh, Leonard Jazz are coming. Here we go. Um, oh, and user-generated content. We've got different shaped rugs, one of them being this really long one. So you could always make it so they have a nice <laughs> queuing rug. <laughs> All right. Nice. <laughs> but what I might do... Let's put it there. Oh, yeah. And that rug could be yours if you go to the Steam Workshop and download my pack now. <laughs> it's in there. Um, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Uh, they've even got a corner rug. I did make one for my pack. There is one in my pack. It's this one here. It's clouds. Oh, that's a bit lit up. It's lit up pretty well. Lit up pretty well. This is one of my favourites though um, from the pack. My Zeke, one of my Zeke posters. Yes. How snazzy is that poster? I really like that poster. I'm really pleased with it. <laughs> really pleased with that one. Look. And we could even put Zeke down. Should we put Zeke in one of the staff rooms? Oh yeah. Look at that. Um, in fact, what we could do is make this match a little bit. We could... Uh, Look, we've got CQ wallpapers available to us. Um, so I do a variety because different rooms have different 3D textures. This one has skirting and coving, which is going to be this one here. There we go. Oh, yeah. And then, uh, and then we could also put in um, some floors, a custom floor. We have, look, I have a nice llama check carpet here that I've made that's in my pack. Um, we have the same again, but it's a smaller pattern. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure I want that in here. Maybe we could try one of the warmer carpets. Look, we have, um, what about Envy? It's the colour of Zeke's eyes. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it strobes a bit, doesn't it? Strobes a bit. I've even put, like, a little texture on the wall. Can you see on the wallpaper there's a little, little texture? Uh, we could put uh, some nice pictures up. Should we put some pictures up? Um, look, uh, Jonty of Geekism made uh, some some great some great posters. <laughs> These are actually going to be better, I think, out in the hospital. Um, but look, we could put. Oh yeah! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Excellent, there we go. <laughs> yeah, uh, all those things are in um, my bundle that you can get. Uh, so no surgery for the time being. Yes, please do come along. Uh, we did it. Uh, again, I find that amazing. Ooh, the machinery. Now, we've been doing a lot of uh, training. So actually, they're, 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 doing, they're doing okay, aren't they? This... This. This. Okay. 
All right. Lovely. Lovely. Right. So, research. Is, is, is Miles ready? My, Miles? What are you doing? He's not quite ready yet, is he? Fair enough, fair enough. But this um, research is almost done, which is fantastic. Really, really pleased about that. Um, but we could do with a bunch more training. So where are we with our GP? So we finally have done level 3 GP, which I'm, I'm actually really, really pleased about. So we could do with um, bumping up some diagnostic skills on our doctors. Um, so what are... Diagnostics treatment is low, so we probably don't need to do. Probably need to concentrate more on their treatment. But these guys can be all diagnostic, can they? What we might do is actually take a plunge here. And train both of them. Uh, <laughs> did you hear that? And um, we'll up, we'll take the time to upgrade these machines. That's what we'll do while that's happening. I think we'll do that. Um, now, stamina training. We could do with some more stamina training. So let's see here. Um, stamina training. There we go. Do that so that our cleanup can go faster given that the hospital is actually physically growing in size um, that might be nice um, we're not going to do diagnostic 2 just yet but we could get Kat and June into some ward management 2 training that would be good um, do you know what? We might train them. Okay, because we get the odd emergency for psychiatry, don't we? And it'd be... I'd like higher success rates out of those. So a bit of training I, I don't think would uh, go amiss. And it's amazing you can see the difference that the training is having on the hospital. It is starting to, uh, to filter out. But then I do stuff like this and it causes problems <laughs> but let's not worry about that let's not worry about it too much it's fine um i don't mind a bit of uh, a bit of rough near the beginning if uh, if if it's pushing towards getting to a smoother sailing uh, hospital faster right oh look at it so beautiful so beautiful ah unlike these lights which are just nowhere near as nice as they used to be. What, what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? This is not good. Can we get a janitor to water this rose bush, please? It's an outrage. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh, this is so close. 97%. Oh, and he's getting really close as well isn't he for his training well done miles we might be able to actually get him trained up very very soon which means we're actually getting pretty close to our second star on this hospital really realistically um because this research is about to be done and then his training is about to be done that cure rate will go up and down but we can see that it is achievable so yeah it's currently 80 percent the drug mixer shall we upgrade it let's do it um yeah in fact actually i think an upgrade will also repair it anyway so Ooh. oh we're so close how are you doing a hundred percent Probably like 99.7% or something. There we go. <laughs> we did it! I think we might also look at... Oh, look at this. We've also got Roderick's plot hole. 
Film star and self-proclaimed writer and director Roderick Cushion has another script that he and his invention team uh, at Plump It Up Productions Limited oh, that's amazing. Uh, just can't seem to finish. So now he's turning to science. If we can conduct some analysis and uh, reconcile the script's plot holes, then uh, they'll send us some money and we'll be included in the credits if this one ever gets made. Uh, this could be a nice little uh, prediction of things to come with Two Point. What if we did have like a Two Point Studios where it was mo movie studios and the radio and, and television programs that you could have produced? And it could be that Plump It Up Productions Limited could be one of the rival uh, production companies uh, producing content, you know, and uh, Two Point Radio with... Uh, of their uh, radio hosts could be a rival for any radio shows that you produce. Oh my god, I'd love that game. Can we have that game? There we go. So, yeah, and it could actually just be called Two Point Studios. <laughs> it's not at all confusing. Uh, we finished our analysis of the Roach Burger menu and sent it off to RB headquarters. Um, they've hired a few dozen lawyers and three gurus and are apparently working on a settlement with the accusers. It's been a great big scandalous mess and our research has been at its juicy and mysterious centre. This... <laughs> I like that. Uh, this has been a great publicity for the Institute, which is now a power in uh, county research again. Fantastic. Hey, that's great. Uh, pandemic, maybe. Uh, go 90 days without a death. Look, we can't do it. You'll only get upset. Um, right, so is he ready? Not quite, but we've given him a research project to do. There we go. <laughs> So it wasn't going to take long. Research three then. Benji. And then that will be our second star, everybody. That will be our second star. So the pandemic emergency. Where is pandemic these days? It's getting an upgrade. So we should probably wait for that upgrade um, to go through uh, before we accept this uh, emergency. Otherwise, they might try and stop. Actually, we could say repair it. And who, who works? Because we can always stop the upgrade, couldn't we, I suppose? Send him on break or whatever. Surgery, no. So it's getting repaired. Who is it? Is it you that does? Hang on a minute. Pandemic is doctor and that's a nurse next door. We've got a nurse treatment room. God damn it. This is a nurse treatment room. Okay, we are going to... We're going to move this back, I think. Because this is where the nurses go. Right. Um, so, our treatment doctor, is it you? Oh, I think it is. I think it's you. Yes, and you're okay. We will just send them on a quick break. This is nice and repaired. Okay. Should we have a quick look at this? Uh, I can't imagine we're doing terribly well. Uh, okay, well we're definitely doing better than I thought. So who's our rising star? Bernard Buzzkill. <laughs> He's our, our rising star. Employer of the Year, Best Teaching Hospital, We're Prestigious, Best Research Hospital and Hospital of the Year. Wow. Um, patient's Choice though, we are not. And uh, I can't see us ever achieving that. <laughs> um, surgery, no. So she's on her break. Plants need water. Oh, do you know what we could do? Another thing that you can do. So you know our beautifully decorated... <laughs> we, I think, we can say apply to all rooms of this type and now all staff rooms. <gasps> it didn't work with the wallpaper. Or the rugs. Did it because I only did the floor? Is that what's so... It won't do it with the items. But if I now do it with... Yeah, so that's how you say it does the wallpaper and the floors, but the items... Okay, that's fine, that's fine. That's probably the way you'd want it to be honest, otherwise it'd be a nightmare, because chances are that staff rooms will be different here and there. 
Right, so how is she... Oh dear, that was a bit juddery. How is she doing on the old relaxation front? Good. Um, so let's call in the emergency. On the way. Um, let's pick her up and pop her in the room. And what we're going to do is keep an eye on this. Um, because... What the hell? What, here's Pat, yeah. Jesus. So, typically, oh no, he is a VIP. Okay. Our very important peeps need attention. So, what we're going to do is watch this and just make sure that um, our mechanic doesn't come along. Uh oh. I can't believe it. That's. That's a shame. That was a shame. In fact, we've probably got too many uh, to do with just one pandemic room. What is this? Yeti sent us hand. Oh, he really likes it again. He's so pleased to see that we're doing well and wishes us the best until we see him again. What a nice guy. We've been sent a reward by the Bigfoot Foundation and get mentioned in their latest newsletter. Wow, he was really pleased with that. That's fantastic. Um, now, how well is she trained? She does have some treatment training. Um, she may not be the best at using this machine. But we'll see. We might. It might help boost this up, though. And get our second star. Wouldn't that be great? Oh, my God. Because as soon as we get our third star, we can go to Rockfall Castle, which is an amazing level. It's an amazing level. Um... But we will come back to these hospitals and clean them all up. And I'm thinking name um, rooms and that after Patreons and give them posters and stuff like that. Oh my god, it's going to be amazing. Yeah. Customise everything. It's going to be the best. And try and get the No Death Awards and stuff like that. Oh, there it is. Yeah! We got the star. Second star. Look at this. And we got the globe. We got a globe. I think that goes in the, um, the staff room. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a two-star rating by the Two Point Health Ministry. There is something uh, quaintly admirable about your pioneering, single-minded spirit that you should choose to ignore the local... Um, what? Let's start that again. That you should choose to ignore the location of civilised life and flippantly plant your flag in such lifeless and distant ground is a reminder of the vitality, instability and sheer stupidity so, char uh, so characteristic of our times. <laughs> Stay in fantasy land for more rewards or return to civilization and get back to work. He's a charmer, isn't he? Um, so 20,000 doubloons and 150 kudosh. Thank you very much. But we are going to remain here. Uh, we got the globe. Let's check this globe out, actually. Um, and while we're here, we're not only going to check the globe out, but look, we also unlocked this red bean bag, didn't we, at Star Level 1? Look at it. Look at it. We've got two different kinds of bean bags now. It's the best. Look, she's straight in there. Mm, yeah. She's straight in there. She's loving it. Yeah, should we check over our stuff, actually? Uh, let's satisfy and give them a pay rise. There we go. Whoops. <gasps> Whoops, the daisies. Um... A patient has expired. And then we also, for this room, we go to recommended. Oh, we don't have the poster. Decorative? We got that poster, didn't we? Do we have to unlock it? No. Look, there it is. A metropolism poster. Not the average day in the average city. <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> Love it. So we got that at star level one as well but now we've also got the globe which i am pretty sure dear it's lots of ding dongs uh get rid of that um i'm pretty sure recommended the globe uh okay decorative where's the globe where's the globe Uh, I don't know. We go to all. Maybe I have to unlock it? Did I go past it? Because this is all now. Maybe it's not staff room. Maybe it's 
goes in here or something. Let's see. If we just do items in general, it's got to be decorative, surely. No. Okay, all. Where's the blob? It might need to go into a specific room. I feel like it would do. There's no way it's going to... Okay, let's try this room. No. Which room does the globe go in? I'm sure it was. I've got some Let's try GP's office. Today. We'll be a call -in competition that will I I've probably just scrolled past it a whole bunch of times and missed it, right? Price. You simply won't believe it. Stick around for an announcement. After this next I'm sure it was the staff room. I'm sure it was the staff room. Uh, well, answers on a postcard, I suppose. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Have I scrolled past it? Have I been have I been a dum dum and scrolled right past it? You'll have to let me know. Um, if you haven't seen it, also let me know that. Um, and then if you do know what rooms I can place it in, let me know that. <laughs> uh, lightheadedness. We don't have a lightheadedness clinic. Really. Should we get one? Um, treatment. Lightheadedness. It won't fit there. That much we know. Um, oh my god. The bongs. To be, good value. to be good value. Let's pop that back there. Okay. I'll pop this in here. There we go. There. Where's the chair? Fantastic. There we go. And then we might just move this back here. Pest control. I can't keep building all this stuff. Uh, <laughs> well, I mean, I can, but I'm not gonna. Um, let's get another one of these. There we go. Right, so let's see here. Our three star achievements need to be looked over so that we can actually start aiming for them. Oh, look at that. Six out of seven. Oh, yeah. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button. As long as you are here, why not take your first step on the path to total coolness by supporting me via Patreon. The cooler you are, the harder I work, which means even more shizwa.